Mzoni amea di sofin sta hae amukuta shoho. Shasha wafetu, naka nilagi tazi dae. Welcome back to the channel. It's a beautiful day today. The birds are singing. I'm one with nature. Today I feel totally worn out. Hair. Even though I don't have hair anymore, but I'm gonna be talking about hair. Why I regret cutting my dreadlocks. I think I've had the dreads since 2016. Yeah, since 2016. Then 2018, I had to cut. I had to cut them. I regretted that shit. Two months later, I was putting dreads again. 20 mid yeah mid 2018 so from 2018 till now I've been growing the dress again so I regret cutting my locks my long hair my long beautiful rich hair my long powerful spiritual hair I regret going chiscop I regret cutting my hair <gasps> <laughs> so when I took the decision to cut my hair, I thought um, it was a symbol of moving on, growth, healing, um, new life, rebirth. And at that particular time, right at that moment, or those few weeks, that's how I felt during you know what, I'm a changed person, I'm now in a journey of self-healing and shit, so let me cut my hair to start afresh, to start over, you know, and I did that. Woke up one morning, cut my hair, told my body, hey dude, nza, 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 nza. then, chin, 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 then, Nicola Sharp, I was cool. A week or maybe a month later, then I started to realize, but no, man. In fact, my locks were actually my identity. Like, my locks were actually um, not what made me. They were a part of me. I felt like I lost a part of me. And which is true, because as soon as you lose your hair, you feel like you lost a part of you. And with me, it's crazy, because I've been growing this thread for over three years now. So you can imagine cutting hair that I've been growing for three years because I thought it was the right move to do at that time because I thought it was the only thing to do at that time because I was beginning my spiritual journey, my self healing journey, you know then, and it's crazy because most people that I met along the way, they knew me with threats, they know me with threats, they made me with threats so now, I get like a cheese go, ah, 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 Antoine, and then when I, Miriri, ah, Antoine, no when I, cheese go, ah, cheese go, pay you twine, shaka fin, ya, and here, what, 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 my hair, I still have them even now. Every time I see them, I have regrets. Why did I cut my hair? <sighs> yeah. So let me tell you something about um black hair. Black hair, black hair is so powerful. Dude. Like black hair, it's so powerful. So black hair is so rich, um, so rich in a way that when it grows. It goes up, it points up, it sticks out, um, like like plants. Black black hair when it grows, it sticks up like plants, like trees. From the roots, it sticks up, so it opposes gravity. Instead of going down, like um, white people say, white people say it's poor, it's it's poor, and that's why when it grows, it it falls down. But ours, ours, our black hair because it's rich and so powerful when it grows and it opposes 
um, gravity, it pulls up. And the way it's black here is so powerful, Katen. it stores electricity and energy. I remember, and I know every black kid wants to this thing, go, go, go scale, go high school, either high school or primary. When you take a ruler and you rub it more like that friction, um, it's electricity. So you take the, you you rub it, rub it, rub it for a few minutes, rub it, rub it, rub it, rub it, rub it, rub it. Then take a piece of paper and you try and lift um, that paper with that ruler. You will see what that paper will actually be absorbed because of that energy friction. So black hair stores energy and electricity. Black hair carries wisdom, information, and knowledge. Ask me why. Because I remember when, when I still when I had dreads. Ne? Ne, 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 not not like you dumb now, but as soon as I cut my hair I felt a sudden change or in me like I was in as intellectual as I was when I had hair. That information that I stored in my brain, as soon as my hair fell down, I felt like it's a million. Nonetheless, I'm still smart, I'm still intelligent, I'm still... But that information, that knowledge, um, that power, that wisdom, available. That's why even, even more Bible, they will tell you um, the story about Samson. Samson had super natural powers. He had unhuman like strength. So as soon as he cut his hair, before going there, so Samson was a guy who believed in uh so so shembe kinda like so Samson Nili Shembe he had big beard he had hair la taka takan and he was tall he was intelligent, he was smart, he was he had wisdom for days, he had knowledge for days, he had strength and power and everything for days, supernatural powers and human like strength. But as soon as he cut his hair, as soon as Delilah in fact cut Samson's hair, what happened to him? What happened to him? He became weak. Why? Because all the powers he had, all the um, unhuman like strength he had, all the wisdom he had, all the knowledge he had, all the information he had, it was in his hair. But as soon as his hair fell down, his wife, and he became weak, he became stupid, not stupid, but he became stupid. <laughs> I'm pretty sure my Christian not enough for saying Samson was stupid, but he became a different person because of his hair. Delilah, Anka, Samson, Amea, Sorpin, Sahai, Amukuta, Shaw, Matla, Afela, Matla, Afela, Shu, Solina, Matla, Aka, Afeli. Have you ever realized or us guys, most of the time, go to our, yeah, now I want a girl with natural, I want a girl with natural hair, um, I don't want a girl with a relaxed hair, I don't want a girl who wears weave. Blow me, ask yourself why. Because black women with natural hair are so attractive to, yo, 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 they're so attractive in New York. They re there's these other hormones that they release in the air with the natural hair that alerts a male person, a guy, or they're ready to mate. It's like female dogs. There's certain hormones that they release in the air, or certain fields, or certain energies. If you know what you are going, please comment, then we'll have a, a, a conversation there in the comment section. A natural woman with natural hair, no makeup, just being in love with her body and aligned and comfortable with her own skin, it's so attractive more than anything in this world. Ladies and gentlemen, if you have hair, long hair, please don't cut it. 
because every spiritual person in the world has long hair. Les angoma, ah, uh, mazangoma in fact, mazangoma, ah, uh, batrofeta, um, the psychic have long hair. It's even worse, Maz uh, mazangoma have the threads. So that's why in the black community or in the black society, as soon as you start growing your hair, but with a shembe, but in a shembe, but as soon as you start looking that long hair with the threads, but with a with a mazangoma. Yeah, so let's go my hair, what, 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 or Babiza Jaman. Because we all know Rastafarians are people with long hair, with long threads. And it's part of their spirituality and it's part of their identity. Lena at some point, the one pizza, um, Jaman. Some people on pizza is angom. It's even worse because when I started my self healing journey, but in Margaret Lezangom, because I used to pray a lot, I used to do candles, uh, color candle, magic prayers um, every week. So, no one pizza Lezangom. So, you can only imagine how powerful a black person's hair is. So, that's it for today. Please don't cut your hair. I regret cutting my hair, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna plant my dress back. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna plant my dress back because after all I still have them camera fella so see, see no later so this is my threads so see no later you'll see me with my threads again I won't throw them away I won't sell them and I also don't understand people who sell um their threads I have people that approach me to sell them my threads and I refuse because I I, would, I don't think I would be comfortable walking around knowing there's someone else out there with my hair on his head. I will rather bend them or I will keep it. Who knows, maybe I might wanna attach them again. And hey, guess what? I will attach them again. So the next time you see me, maybe next year, maybe, I don't know, as soon as my hair grows, as soon as I fix my, my f issue, which is cop, I will attach my threads again but for now narali ina pitati dai spiderman samutsuana the guy who regrets cutting his threads please like subscribe comment and share with your friends and family and if you know the name of that hormone that female dogs releases in the hair that alerts male dogs that they're ready to meet please comment below and Please like, subscribe, comment, and share for more related content. Thank you very much. Let me go. Grow my hair. It will take time, but yeah. <laughs>